guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you my favorite amazon face masks i know it's a real controversial issue and there's people with very strong opinions on both ends whether we shouldn't or should wear the face mask but here in florida pretty much everywhere you go they're required so something as small as a grocery store that you need to go and do the ups theme parks and pretty much any public place where you're going to be walking by people or just coming in close contact they really want you to be wearing these masks so i think you can see somebody wearing a great outfit have their hair makeup and jewelry bag everything so amazing and then they have a paper face mask and i feel like it just kills the whole look so I have some really great, comfortable, st as stylish as they can be masks and some tips for you guys as well. If you like these kind of videos, make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and let's get on with the haul. Okay, so my first masks are my favorite masks to wear indoors. They come either reversible or adjustable so mine are the reversible ones i have not purchased the adjustable ones so it does have you know a ready set strand of elastic that you can alter if that's what you want to do and you wanted that reversible with a print and then a solid there is a bunch of different ones i have the leopard and the black and um, like blue and white stripe with lemons and then white so the thing I love about these is they're really, really soft. They're like 90 something percent polyester and the rest is spandex. They're very comfortable. It's like having a cozy blanket on your face, especially if you're like an, in a really high air conditioned building. These are really, really cozy. You also have the ability to, and this is what I love, is it has a place to put in a filter. When you're indoors, you want that extra protection um, and it is really, really comfortable. So that's what I like about that. I do have a bigger face, so it just fits on me very snugly. Um, if you're smaller, you can, I guess you can put like a clip on, on the end or tighten it somehow or just go for the single um, fabric and get adjustable but I wouldn't like if you're I wouldn't recommend these to men they are more geared towards women like they have a woman's face on the the model the show so I really love about these masks is their ability to be styled very easily because you have really classic colored prints on one side and then you have that solid black on this one and then there's white on this one. But with this black and white leopard, I, there's so much you can do with it. I think this would look so good with tie dye, with just solid colored tank tops or prints, um, black, all black, all white. So um, you know what else would really look good with this? Like a tropical dress with like hibiscus flowers, really fun summery prints, and then this black and white snow leopard. Um, florals this, I love like floral with leopard print together I think there's just like a nice little like shabby chic kind of look um, you can also do like leopard um, with the black side I know a lot of celebrities are doing like all monochromatic so if you're wearing like a black dress you do a black mask black tank top and the black mask or what you could even do like what I'm wearing now all white I'm wearing white jeans and then a black mask, a black bag, and black shoes. So that would really, you know, if you just had the black mask, that would make a really nicely styled outfit. What you could do with this blue and white striped and the lemons on one side and white on the other. You always have that white neutral that'll go with everything. So you can, of course, do all white or do like the reverse with the black. So if you had an all black outfit and all white accessories, that's really cute for summer and kind of makes a black outfit look a little bit more summery and um like any kind of white jeans and any color top so if you're doing white jeans and a pink tank top and then the white mask i think that'll be really cute and then with the lemon side so you can do what i've seen a lot of like 
celebrity is doing with prints is they're using like the same color so they have a blue and white in this um you know it's obviously striped but then they'll have a blue and white polka dot dress or a polka dot mask with the same colors only a different print of the dress or just like some of those colors mixed into the dress the next masks are my favorite mask to wear outside so they come in a bunch of different prints i think they do have some solids they come one two three or four in a pack and they're all over amazon um they are like a chiffon material i don't know what it's made out of but they are very sheer they are a solid fabric so you are allowed to wear them in the theme parks i've worn these for hours and haven't had any complaints from me or my kids my toddler wears it they do have an adjustable strap on it that you can pull and tighten it so they can fit on small children's faces but the thing about them the reason that they're not very easy to find is they are advertised with this like sheer scarf portion underneath so i know a lot of people wear these to like work they look really pretty like a little sheer scarf you know just an extra little accessory but for me being outdoors in florida for hours i want as little fabric on me as possible I like it. it's just really easy to breathe through and perfect you're, you're outdoors anyway i think if you're worried about being in an indoor place with this then bring another mask but if you're going to be outside for long periods of time then this is so perfect um well like i said it is attached to this scarf but you can easily pull it off i did it with all four i got the four pack it pulls right off and um it, it didn't not one of mine got ruined so if you want to be extra careful you could use like a seam ripper or something that's going to get it off a little bit better i mean so i think that's all that's kind of messed up and i could just trim it but other than that it's a completely finished seam so they are creating these masks and then sewing this on afterwards not really sure why so for comfort a plus and then they're pretty so they are in this like pretty soft chiffon fabric perfect for like an outdoor wedding i mean this floral um print it's i love it it's pink it's roses with like a baby blue fabric so really super pretty i um for my birthday i wore the lily pulitzer dress universal and i was a little upset that i didn't have the matching lily pulitzer mask if you had i had this i wore this and my 13 year old said wow your mask matches your dress perfectly so you don't need to get like the matching designer fabric that you're only going to wear with one particular outfit or uh, these are just as good so this is one this is another one this is the one that lily usually wears because she has like a lot of pink clothes so this is white with just pink flowers and like it's adjusted up for her little head so it, this fits around her mouth perfectly she doesn't complain she's only three and she can wear this all day and be okay this next mask i purchased because i found out theme parks were opening i knew it was going to be hot and i knew we were going to have to wear a mask so i didn't know what to expect i didn't wear a mask before this um they kind of just started being rolled out to us when the theme parks opened so i bought this it's a hat but it does have a mask attached to it it's a sun hat so it is made for the heat it has a really nice breathable fabric it's made to get wet so if you get caught in the rain and what i really like is this there's this huge brim so you are getting protection from the sun you don't need sunglasses with it and it's just really lightweight fabric there's a ponytail hole so to get your hair off your neck and it is adjustable there's these two straps that you can tie a bow and tie it tighter or looser i have a pretty big head and i haven't had an issue with it so with the mask portion it is attached so if you don't need the mask you can just throw it to the back and put it on your head so i'll show you guys so like that and um you know you got your sun protection and then let's just say 
you are going to an outdoor event. I know these are not allowed at Universal anymore. They just changed the rules this past couple days where you have to wear ear masks, but we were able to wear these to get like a little bit of a breather. You know, you can get air in here. It's just covering your face. So this is what it looks like with the mask portion. So you do have that face covering, you do have that air going in, so you don't have something squeezing your face. But it is just like a nice cute little outdoor accessory. I think if you were, like I said, if your kid plays sports and you're gonna be outside or you're walking in the park, or somewhere that where there isn't huge restrictions on what you're allowed to wear i think this is perfect i think that this would be so cute with an athletic outfit so like a little black and white or black or white like like tennis outfit a little black adidas skirt and a tank top or you can even wear like a little black sundress a black romper um if there's all different colors in this so you can pretty much mix and match your outfit to the hat um i know they do sell other hats like this they might have like solid colors so if the polka dots are a little too much for you you can get like a solid color one but this is just i think it's really really cute and do have some mask tips i, I know a lot of people have been talking about the makeup and masks and how makeup gets on their mask or they're not wearing makeup because it'll get on their mask or they're getting acne and i haven't had any issues like that at all it could be the mask i'm using or it could be the makeup i'm using so i figured i'd show you, share with you guys really quick the makeup i've been using so for foundation i use the revlon color stay it's um i've used this forever and it does have an spf in it so this is like a long lasting foundation and then for lipstick i always use a matte long wear lipstick um, right now I'm wearing the Maybelline Superstay in the color 15. It's called Lover. And I haven't had any issues with the foundation or the lipstick. And then, of course, you want to use a setting spray that's going to really make sure none of your makeup gets off on your mask. So I've been using the Urban Decay All Nighter. So I think these three things together have been perfect for me so if you want to try wearing makeup under your mask i definitely recommend these okay so those are my favorite amazon masks if you have any masks that you've been loving make sure you comment it down below give this video a thumbs up subscribe if you're new and i'll see you in the next one bye